What is up? My amazing people. All right, thanks for coming in once more to my channel. Uh, we are discovering the Wheel of Misfortune here in Vegas. It's a few, like maybe two minutes away from Lake Las Vegas and we're just discovering it. An artist named Awake actually created this through all graffiti all around. They're big giant circles and you pretty much go and discover them all. And, um, and he actually graffitied some that I'm gonna show you guys um, and just pretty much putting like uh, zero signs and then also, you know, losing your home. It's just kind of like a losing of misfortune type of thing, a wheel of everything you can lose. And this was actually created in 2012. And I thought it'd be pretty cool to take you guys along the ride so you guys could see it, see all the cool graffiti and take you guys along for this adventure. All right, let's get it. all right as you can see it is very messy like there's a lot of trash around but um it is worth coming and seeing you get some pretty cool pictures if you're into that like antiqueness and like graffiti walls everywhere type of pictures this is the place for you it's a great place to just come out and just explore um again you'll see like all of these places that say zero and then you'll say like lose home lose job lose everything because that's what Vegas is kind of known for, right? Like, it's known for it to be losing everything. You come and you lose money, you lose everything. But I think in my eyes, it's an eye-opener to being that we can't be satisfied into this world and give all of ourselves to this world because we'll end up in a misfortune. We'll miss out on everything that we have just for a moment of pleasure. So life in general is a gamble, just like this. So I feel like it was a really cool eye-opener for you to see everything. Uh, and I hope you guys enjoyed walking around with me and exploring this wheel of misfortune. Dun, dun, dun. You know, 
know, we see here that graffiti artist went ahead and uh, created this for us to kind of reflect and say, hey, you know, we we can't go out and and try to uh, gamble all of our lives out there. So it was really cool to come and explore it. I had never been here, so it was a cool experience to come and show you guys. Also something you guys will see a lot are these. You guys will see a lot of spray cans around just because people just come and express themselves and aren't able to do so. It's, I don't think you get fined for anything like this because it's actually meant for you to express yourself, show your graffiti, show your artwork here. As we saw there was a person already um, creating something for, for like the whole mural. It pretty much becomes a zone of art which is beautiful I think. You get to express yourself in an artistic way. It becomes an art piece for others to see. And people like myself can come and enjoy it. <laughs> All right, y'all. And today's word of the day would be hope. I never want you guys to lose hope in life and everything that you have going on. We all have different crazy uh, lives. But what's beautiful about it is that whatever I've gone through, I can actually be a blessing for other people for not to fall in the same um, in the same rock. We have to help each other out and make sure that we don't go all crazy and insane in this world because I think we all need each other. Life is definitely a puzzle and I think the most important thing is if we work together to build it up a bit more, the easier it'll be and the more satisfaction we'll learn about life itself. Through any problem that you're going through, just think before you were able to surpass something way bigger and are able to surpass this as well at its time. Learn as much as you can. Take a step back and learn patience. Learn what you have to in this trial and make sure you embrace it in the future. Make sure that everything negative, you can make it into a positive because everything is for good. If we had everything, we'd be selfish kids. I mean, come on. If I had everything I wanted, I don't know where I'd be. But thankfully, I am able to keep life going, be satisfied with everything that I have and everything that I have been given and be able to appreciate all of my friends and family and every relationship that I've been able to build. Living a life of something that we always want is never going to satisfy as much because the more we have something, the more we want more of it. So I think it's important to stay humble, to stay ourselves, to stay, stay centered and have that hope that things will fall into its place as they have to. You might not understand it right now, but don't worry. Everything has a purpose and everything has its own plan to fall into its place at its own time. So go out and enjoy the life that you have right now because we don't know if we have tomorrow promised. Okay, guys? All right, guys. These are my buddies for today. Hola, como estas? Hola. Say <laughs> konnichiwa. What were your thoughts of this Wheel of Misfortune? It was very fortunate. It was <laughs> I liked it a lot. Yeah. Very peaceful, it. fun, mm -hmm. relaxing scene. It's kind of like a museum yeah. for yeah. free. And there's no stairs when you go into the pit, so you gotta like, you know, maybe the odds ever be in your favor for that. Yeah. Because thanks to them and another person, they got me out. Bring a helicopter. <laughs> bring a helicopter, you know, be prepared. Bring an yeah, escalator, a, a chair. Yeah, bring your own ladder, Anything, please. yeah. Or donate it to the pit and just like glue it there. <laughs> and then right on it, don't touch it. Exactly. You touch you die. Oh, it was crazy, but it's actually fun. No, 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 no. <laughs> well, bye. 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 See you tomorrow. <laughs> Gonna go get some yogurt. Thank you guys so much for tuning in into my episode today. 
I had a blast discovering all of this Wheel of Misfortune. If you guys liked it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and put that bell notification thingy on. That way we can see each other the next time I post, the next time I go on a little adventure and take you guys along. I'd love to, for you guys to be a part of it. Stay awesome. Remember, you are the light of the world. And don't let anybody dole that shine that you got going on. Alright, adios amigos.